Hey guys and welcome back to the channel. So today we are revisiting Beyond Skyrim Bruma. I made a video on this back in like sometime in the summer. I don't even know when. It's been a while and I said that I was wanting to do at least a part two of it but I hadn't gotten to it and so I wasn't sure if it was still relevant or if you guys were still interested but you guys seem to be so we are going to be playing some more and I'm so excited because I have not played it since that video and I'd really like to see more. So yeah, let's just go ahead and get back into it. You know what's even more satisfying than arresting a criminal? Seeing them rot in a cell. What a nice thing to come back to. Thanks, guy. So we are exactly where I left off, right in front of the castle of Bruma. Once again, playing as Adamo, my secondary dragonborn. And yeah, I want to see the inside of this castle because it's been months <laughs> and I've been wanting to. But I just haven't gotten to it. To oh. I don't suppose you've seen any priceless Sakaviri heirlooms gallivanting around Bruma, have you? I don't think so. I could lie to him, say, actually, yes, I have a whole barrel of them in my pack. No heirlooms, sorry, and I'm sorry, what? I think Adamo would probably Sakaviri be just like, heirlooms. what? <laughs> priceless Sakaviri heirlooms. Seen any? No. Oh, I guess that just looped us. No heirlooms, sorry. Sorry to bother you, citizen. Hmm. Just, uh... Let me know if any do crop up, yeah? Thanks. Okay. What's all this about a lot of uproar the heirlooms? About nothing, that's why. The Count's been nagging my life and soul out about the damn thing. Ah, uh, okay, so it's the Count. You see, the Count Carvane. Oh, so the isn't Count. Too happy that his collection's been stolen. The Count's collection has been stolen. Okay, could you use I... some help? Well, that's. Ah, <laughs> oh, who am I kidding? Absolutely. This is driving me crazy. <laughs> Just bring them back to me. When okay, you yeah, we'll bring you I if we find any. We'll bring them to you. Seriously, can't talk. Offing myself right about now. Cool. So we have another quest, but oh my god, the nostalgia! I want to play Oblivion again so bad. <laughs> like I cannot even express to you guys how much I want to start that series, but I need to wait for Morrowind to be over, or at least the main story of it. So I've been like putting it off because I want it to not be as fresh in my mind. I want things to surprise me again and whatnot. And it hurts. But like, oh, look at this. I guess the count's not out because, you know, it's 4 a.m. Let's wait a little bit, see if they show up. Hello, anyone? Oh, <gasps> the black horse courier. Oh, oh, and that looks like some of the blades armor, like Let's Akaviri type of armor. That's so cool! Oh, and the shields! This is so amazing. Oh, hey, they're all eating back here. Oh, oh your dress! Happy. That reminds me so much of Oblivion. I wonder why. Oh, are you the Count, you I guess? You Welcome are. Welcome to our fair city. What brings you to Bruma? You know what? We can talk to you. Do you need something? Um, what do I want to say? What can you tell me about Bruma? Bruma is the jewel of the Gerald Mountains. A mm -hmm. strong and hardy city. Imperial in name but equally Nordic by blood. And while the county surrounding up, her is frosty, <laughs> as Viscount Carvain says, the hearts of our people burn brighter than... We have okay, our so he's just problems. talking about his people. Do you have any quests for me? Reville, Bruma might as well be paradise. And at least we were spared the horrors mm. of the Great War. Mostly. So yeah, I'm not going to talk to him too much. Uh, glad to see Teldrin has made a friend over there. Just, just going to eat some breakfast. <laughs> But yeah, we might see if we can find some of the heirlooms, but I do want to go somewhere in particular. Now that we've gotten to see the palace or the castle. It's called a castle, not a palace. This is just so cool. I'm like in awe again because it's been a few months. Today. Huh? Rizada the resplendent. Enchanter extraordinaire. Oh. Illusionist in He sells do stuff? You need something? I'd like to see your unique enchanted items. Uh, of course, of course. Excellent. Well, I have five fabulous unique items. Okay, I get First it. Is the wooden staff of awesome conflagration. Okay. Second is the scepter of frosty entombment, which is true. Trap your target in a block of ice for 10 minutes. Ooh. I bet these are expensive though. To shrink. To shrink becoming I want that one. The staff of titan summoning. Oh, but that's tempting too. Oh, there's so many. Ah. Uh. Will <laughs> certainly so, which will it be? Oh god, how much money do I have? Can I just buy all of them? I want this one for ah, sure. Will go running home to I have no idea how much money I have. Let's try this one too. Ah, your foes will cow 
I apparently have a good. Uh, oh no, I don't. But you don't no. Uh, for such a transaction. I might come back and buy some more later. I'll probably just give myself the money. So, um, which one do we want to try first? Can I just summon him here? Is that gonna be a crime? Let's just boop. Yeah! Look at that! A bunny. I'm I'm actually sad. That was my friend. That was my friend! Ah! Uh, is that all it does? Oh I'm emotional. I'm sad. Okay, we're gonna test out this sword on Gone Air. That hurt me! That wasn't supposed to happen. Guy! These are rigged. I feel cheated. What the heck? I'm gonna go yell at him if I can. <laughs> this item I bought from you seems a little poor. Ah, uh, you've purchased yourself a fine enchanted item from Bris. I make yeah. I make my refund policy clear. That is, there are no, no refund. I mean, not no policy. There is a policy. Very much so. In fact. Of course. He said nothing about a refund policy. I'm gonna be all like high elf. Like, can I speak to your manager? My sincerest apologies, but all sales are final. Hmm. Let's let's say if you give me a refund, I won't call the guards. Fine, fine. Here's your reimbursement. Very good, very good. <sighs> cool. But do I get to keep the weapons? Is there some do I get to keep them? Oh hey! I could just get my money back. I'm just gonna need something? you know, buy some more. Uh, of oh, we're gonna have to go through this again. <laughs> let's just um I don't I don't remember what he said about this one, so I'm gonna get it. Why not? And I don't remember that one either, but this one seemed cool. Truly chill your It'll probably just uh, freeze me, but you know. For science, we will test it. For our potency. Uh, do I aim it at someone or do I aim it at the ground? Oh god. Yeah! <laughs> That's exactly what I wanted. How long does this last? <laughs> no! Adam, are you okay? Oh no! Oh, there we go. Okay, he's fine. You know, that wasn't so bad. I enjoyed it. It it was right. It did bring some pleasure. That's good. Now let's try this one. How much you want to bet it's just gonna freeze me? We're, we'll test it out on you this time. Yeah, it, look how it's- look how it's trying to aim? That's gonna be on me. Uh. <gasps> I'm a chicken! Oh! <laughs> yes! Bye! I'm out. This is my life now, and I'm perfectly fine with it. Yes. This is the best thing I've ever bought. Hi, lady! Are my followers still following me? No, they just- they probably don't even know where I went. They're just like... What- what just happened? What? Friends, please! Oh god. Go back up there. No! I wanna be a chicken! Become a chicken again! <laughs> yeah, uh, I think they kinda... Freak out. Oh, oh I fell! Oh god, I died! Oh, what just happened? I tripped down the stairs! Did that kid just loot me? I tripped down the stairs and died! No, now I don't have any of them! Oh well, that just means I have money to buy the others! I don't remember which ones I did and didn't buy though. Where was he? Oh gosh. Ah, here he is. Okay. I'm sorry, I'm having too much fun with this. So we didn't try this one, right? Right? I feel like we tried all the rest, so we'll just try this one now. Summon an arcane inferno on target. Okay, one of my elf boys, please come here. It's probably just going to hurt me. Y yeah, yeah. It just, it likes to be on fire. Hey look, I have Ancestor's Wrath now. Do dark elves like me now? Do I fit in? <laughs> probably not. Well, that was weird. Let's just, you know, leave. <laughs> because I want to go see if I can find Apple Watch. Now, like I said, it's been a while since I've played Oblivion, but I feel like it's somewhere off in this direction. And I think whenever I played this mod the first time, we saw some signs for it, so hopefully I can find it. Oh, this is just, it makes me so happy. Like. I want to play Oblivion again so bad! Ugh. 
And I don't want to have like a million series going on at the same time, you know? You know? That'd be hard. And I already hardly keep up with what I already do. You know, we're just kind of looping around the city. I guess we could see a uh, Cloud Ruler Temple. There could very easily be an episode 3 of this, because I don't think I can get to everything in like two episodes, you know? This might just have to be a little mini series or something that maybe I'll actually remember to upload at least like once every other week, if not more. Oh, Bruma Caverns. Oh. Um, maybe we'll go in there sometime. But I either want to see Cloud Ruler Temple or Apple Watch. I wonder if that house icon. Surely it has to be one of them, but Cloud Ruler Temple I thought was kind of more up on the mountain. Surely that's still a thing. It might have been destroyed, but I want to say I've seen screenshots of it. Oh look, Motherwort. That's an oblivion. That's so cute. Oh, what's all this? Hello. Well, the sign to Apple Watch is pointing this way. Is this Apple Watch now? Oh, it grew. <gasps> Look at the windmill. Okay. Okay, I need a screenshot. Look how beautiful. Oh, chickens. Okay. This is amazing. Oh my gosh. Oh god. Oh no. I should not have done that there. Okay. Oh, hi. Hello. Welcome. Welcome to Apple um, Watch. What is this apple place? Watch? Just a humble apple orchard and a humble family turning those apples With some dark history. Nothing glamorous. Wait, wait, wait. Can I just... Oh, not my inventory. What am I doing? Can I just summon Lucian? I do have Lucian. Hey, look! You remember this place? It looks much different. It has grown. But this is where Lucian the Chance dies. Spoilers. But I'm sure if you know who Lucian is, you probably know. Is, this is the house here, isn't it? Or is it over here? Because there were graves. I guess I never killed the Emperor. So, um, Lucian, could you be a little bit quiet? Because we're in Cyrodiil right now, you know? There's lots of Imperials around. Oh, wait. Oh, there they are. Okay. Oh. So, in Oblivion, if I remember correctly, like I've said, it's been a long time. One of I'm physically about to fight Lucian, but yeah, you have to kill a family that lives here. And these are their graves. Oh my god, that's dark. Where I don't think the whole family lives here, I think a lot of them are like all over the place. I can't remember for sure, because it's been so long, but that's their graves, so I'm glad to see that's still there. I want to say this is- maybe it is this house, I don't remember what it's shaped like. I I regret summoning him so much, actually. Um, I'm probably about to murder him, to be honest. Uh, is anybody gonna care if I just, uh, you know... Hold on, I need to see what the layout is again, because this kind of looks like it. But I want to make sure. Okay, so yeah, this is definitely the house. For some reason I was thinking it was the rectangle one, but it's definitely this one. <sighs> and the music is, like, kind of making me emotional right now. Oh my god. So yeah, how you feeling, Lucian? You like it here? You remember this? Probably. Oh, look at all the furniture. Ooh, that bed. It's very nice, actually. Hopefully no one comes in and gets upset at me for being here, but... Oh, the beds are so cute! Wow! So that, that hurt just a little bit. Just a little. Oh, look at all the birds! Oh! That's so cool! I love that so much. Oh, and here's all the trees. Oh, we can harvest them. Are you an adventurer? Oh, You're an I kind of, before I end, I kind of want to go down here, if I can, see if I can get into some of the greenery. Because Cyrodiil is just so beautiful with all its trees. I really hope, and I bet they have been able to capture that feeling if you're able to get to the greener parts. Which looks like you can, because I see a dungeon down there. This is just huge, like... <gasps> Ow. I wasn't expecting it to be like this just like filled with content. They did so good on this. Like, I know I've said it before, but I'll say it a million times. Oh great. Oh great. Hi. They are powerful. Just, just a tad. Um, might die. I'm gonna let my elves- Wait, Teldrin, why are you casting spells? You are a swordsman. Uh, you know you can't cast spells. Ooh, ooh, no, no, no. Please, someone take care of that for me. Oh, that was disgusting. You are Nerevar, Teldrin. What the? He's not staying in character today, is he? 
Oh, oh no, the fox! <gasps> Who did that? Because it like disintegrated. That was a lightning spell. I can only assume Gonair did. Where is he? How could you? Oh, it started to rain. They put on their stupid hoods. Now you have your sword out. You're supposed to fight with your sword. Custom followers, man. Oh, what is this place? So I'm definitely getting like Falkreath vibes around here, which is great because Falkreath is probably my favorite. I just, I love forests a lot. Oh god, Lucian. How'd you get down there? <laughs> Being chased by what, a thief? Wow. Oh, highwayman. I'm afraid this is a premium oh. highway. And as such, passage requires a reasonable little toll payment. Mm, How about it, I think not. I'm not giving we'll you anything. See if you put up this much of a fight when you're lying dead on the ground. Good luck with that. You're wearing like such bad armor, though uh, he did kind of hit kind of hard. But you know, I got a lot of elves with me. I got Lucian. Didn't stand a chance. And that's why I love having a million followers <laughs> all the time. I usually have more than this. So like, oh. Colovian fur armor. That's so cool. Something still attacking us. Oh, what are you? Hello. You a goblin? <gasps> wow! Oh, I shouldn't have killed you so fast, huh? There's a goblin! Oh, he's gross. That's disgusting. Wow. <laughs> oh my gosh! No, you come here. I need to look at you. You're so cute! <gasps> look at them! <laughs> That's adorable! What is this up here? This might be one of the last things we're going to find today, and then... Maybe in the future we'll actually do some quests. Oh. <gasps> Plump rat camp. Oh, look at the little tents. But, um, we're being attacked, so friends, can you appear? Thank you. I still- you're not an archer either. Ugh. He's having like an identity crisis, I think. Ooh, he did like a flip. That was impressive. They keep doing flips. Got there, no! <gasps> Ooh, look at her armor. You can't see it because she's on fire, because Teljin thinks he's a mage. Yeah, get your freaking sword out. Ugh. Khajiit! So sorry, Khajiit! Oh gosh, I'm out of magic. Deldrin! Deldrin! Help! Thank you. Even though- why? Or just why? You have a, such a good sword! Oh no! Oh gosh, okay, fair. We're fine. We're fine. He's fine, see? He just has an arrow going through his- Yeah, it's not even going through him, it's going through his hood. We're all good. Era's Amulet of Talos. Ooh, I bet that's for a quest. Iron Armor of the Minor Knight. <gasps> I kind of want to try that on. Oh, look at that! That's so cool. Okay, I might leave this on. Yeah. It <laughs> increases heavy armor skill, which doesn't help me whatsoever, but you know? I really like the way it looks. That looks really good. But yeah, on that note, I think I'm going to go ahead and leave this episode here. Leave a like if you enjoyed it and you want me to do more episodes of this series. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye!